26th edition of the International Association of Maritime Economists conference is currently underway in Shanzu, Mombasa. The conference, a four-day event, has been hosted in Kenya for the first time and has brought together over 330 global researchers, policymakers and industry stakeholders in maritime economics, policy and management. The theme of the conference is Sustainable Maritime port and logistics industries in emerging economies towards a path of blue growth. The opening ceremony was presided over by the Secretary General of the United Nations Conference on Trade and Development, Dr. Mukisa Kitui, who underlined the crucial role of maritime trade in developing economies. Let's listen in our reporter, Abi Agena, who's following up on this story. Well, uh, many thanks, uh, Jesse. Indeed, this particular conference uh, is quite uh, timely for Kenya, pretty much when the country is trying to expand the ecosystem when it comes to the port. And of course, uh, Kenya currently serves over 80 countries through the port of Mombasa, mainly based here in Africa. But the bigger scope of this uh, particular conference, JC, is really trying to see how can countries uh, sort of have sustainable growth of their blue economies. And let me now bring in uh, one of the key experts who was part of this particular conference and is from Greece. Greece is one of the countries that has one of the best uh, port systems in the world. And many thanks. Uh, Dr. Jason for making time for us. Well, thank you. Thank you for your invitation. Well, uh, this particular conference is very important from a sense of peer learning. What are some of the things that uh, stood out for you during the discussions earlier in the day? Uh, one of the things that stood out uh, it's the huge potential that I think that Kenya has uh, in order to play uh, a very uh, important ro role mm -hmm. serving the African continent. And uh, for Kenya as a country, we are trying to up our game when it comes to the logistics business. Uh, we still have challenges when it comes to facilities and, uh, of course, uh, the capacity from a, a, a standpoint of engineering. And uh, what are some of the key areas that you think African countries need to improve on to grow their logistics business? I wouldn't go that far. Uh, as to logistics or capacity, I would focus on uh, infrastructure first. I mean, an essential infrastructure like security and transport. Mm -hmm. And all the other things are going to follow. All right. And uh, finally, one of the other bigger conversation is... Uh, Looking at intra-Africa trade, uh, how do we grow intra-Africa trade with uh, partnerships out of conferences like this? I think uh, a conference like this, it's a global conference that changes continent every, every year, uh, has grown so that people from Australia, from the US, from Africa, from Europe, from Asia, are, are joining this conference. So it's, it's a, good, uh, a good place for academics. Uh, to, to exchange ideas and also for practitioners to uh, uh, discuss and uh, expand their views about ports and uh, shipping. Thank you, sir. Really, really a pleasure having you on board. Well, uh, that is one of the key uh, participants in this particular conference talking to us uh, on the sidelines of the International Association of Maritime Economists, a big conference happening here in Nairobi, actually here in uh, Mombasa, where we've been seeing uh, quite a lot uh, coming out, uh, J uh, Jesse, when it comes to addressing matters of logistics. Well, Kenya has huge potential to grow the logistics business as well as uh, the blue economy. Of course, from 3 p.m., we shall be having business today from here and expect much more from this end. Well, thank you, 